Daytime is prime time on WSNS Channel 44, Chicago. Hello, sports fans. It's me, sports fan Z, Bob Zolke. Today I am here with two games against the Milwaukee Brewers. Now, if you recall, we played the Milwaukee Brewers before, and we played them at home. So this is going to be our first two games on the road against the Brewers. And um, as you can see right up there at the top of the screen, it's going to be Ronaldo Lopez going up against Josh Lindblom. So let's get on with it. I'm pretty excited to see a new stadium for once other than our own so that is the end of our 22 game home streak um so we have to switch these uh human here and computer over here and uh yeah i'm gonna go with uh and that means we don't have the dh either so um i don't know why in canarcion though is at second base that probably would not be the greatest of ideas Somehow he's a second base 5E71, which, you know, I can admire the fact that he wants to get a guy that's in there that's, um, that can hit, that can really hit. But um, I, I don't want a guy in there that badly that can hit. So this is, uh, yeah, this is the lineup I'll go with. And um, we'll get on with it. I always forget the volume. I always forget the volume. All right, there we go. We are in whatever their stadium is, County Stadium or whatever. No, that's the old one. Home run one to ten, but no, it's Lewis Robert hitting a double into the gap. He's going shopping at the gap. So now we've got Lurie Garcia. You know what? I should probably try to bunt him over. I should. And uh, yes, it worked. So we got Moncada up and one out and Robert 90 feet away. And he's going to pop out. So that's not going to work. See, this is what I, I'm telling you. This is why I hate bunting. Because it does not work. We did not get him home. It did not help us at all. And in fact, it may have hurt because Lori Garcia, who knows, he could have gotten a hit. All right, we're going to pitch to Kane. It's going to be a ground ball. If you remember Lopez last time out, he was magnificent. And we're hoping for another performance like that. And Justin Smoke is going to line out. So they go down one, two, three in the first. And now we're in the top of the second. With Grand Dahl up, the former uh, former Brewer himself, he gets a board. And Jimenez is up. He's going to hit a fly to right, but that's Yelich, so that's probably going to be played. I mean, let's not kid ourselves here. All right, and Mazar is up with one out, and Grand Dahl aboard, and that's going to be a pass ball. So Grand Dahl moves to second, and you've got um, Mazar still up, and he's flying out. So it's going to be Grand Dahl at second with two down, and Madrigal up for his second game, and there he goes, doubling into the gap and driving that run home. Madrigal, man, he's been money since he's come up. And now Lopez, so, you know, that's the end of that. So Hira is going to lead off for them in the bottom of the second. He'll hit the second base. That's Madrigal. And that's an out. And if you can guarantee if Encarnacion had been there, it would not have been an out. So Garcia's gone. Our, our former man... Avisail Garcia, and now here's another former man of ours, Narvaez. He's out. So uh, another masterful job by Lopez. And we got Lewis Robert up. 
it's going to be a fly ball to center. Of course, that's Kane. If anybody can track that ball down, Kane can. And uh, so that brings up Lurie Garcia. And he is going to single. That brings up Mancata. And he pops out. And now Abreu. And he strikes out. So we still got the one nothing lead. We're going to the bottom of the third. Sogard up at the plate and popping out. Brings up Brock Holt. And he is going to ground it. Well, hit, the, hit it on the ground to short. And it gets away. And, uh, yeah, he throws it into the stand. So Holt is on second. But there's a strikeout of Lindblom. They had the let hit. And now Kane is up. And he's going to ground out. Grand Dahl is up. I'm going to let him swing away. Top of the fourth. He grounds out. Jimenez strikes out, and Mazzara is up, and he is going to hit a single. So Mazzara is aboard with two down, top of the fourth, and Madrigal up, and Madrigal out. So it brings up Yelich. Another thing I like about this is it gives me more like managerial decisions to make because the pitcher's batting, so I have to decide. Even if um, dude is pitching well, should I take him out? Smoke just singled. So he's aboard with one out, and that's another single followed, following him up with Hura's single. And now Avasail Garcia is going to strike out. So they got two down and two on. And Narvaez up. And he's walking to load the bases. And now Sogard, and it looks like it's going to get by Grandall. So that's going to let the run score, and Sogard still gets to hit. And he lines up. So a run came in because the ball got past uh, Grandall, and now Lopez is up, but it's 1 1. I'm going to let him keep stay in the game and hit, and he strikes out. That brings up Lewis Robert. And he's going to hit a triple one to three, but no, it's a single. We got Lewis Robert aboard. I'm going to see if I can steal. Going to attempt it. Uh, I'm still going to attempt it. You know what? 50%? No, didn't work. And now Lurie Garcia is up. That was the gambler in me. Kind of didn't work. Brock Holt is up against Lopez and he'll fly out. That brings up Josh Lindblom, the pitcher, and he hits the ball to second, but that's Madrigal. Oh, man. He got a single out of that. But Kane hit into a double. Thank goodness for Kane. So Moncada steps up. Top of the sixth. It's getting late. And he is going to be out. Brings up a Brave. Who really is having a terrible season for us. I think. I don't remember specifically. But it just seems like it. But you ever do that where you're, you're playing a season. And it just seems to you like a guy is either great or he's terrible. And you look him up, you look up his stats, and you say, wow, he's really not that bad. And Randall is not that bad because he's just doubled. So with two on, or no, with Grandall on and two outs, we have Jimenez. Oh, he brings in a pitch, a relief pitcher. All right, I got Jimenez up, and he walks. Now Mazzara's up. And he strikes out. We had a shot there, I thought. We go to the bottom of the sixth, and that's going to be a single for Yelich to lead off the inning. 
Uh, I'm, uh, I'm just going to pitch. And he's down to 65, but, in the, you know, if that was me, I was. Yeah, I'm going. Not in time, uh, no. Two on and no outs and Hira up. But he hits into a ground ball double play. Thank goodness. We needed that. All right, so Garcia's up. I'm going to pitch to him, and, and it pays off. And now if Lopez comes up this inning, he's gone. And he will. After Madrigal. So that's going to be a strikeout, and I'm going to pinch hit for Lopez. Uh, let's see. Jackson's a righty who's a 5R. Let's get Tilson in there. Tilson hasn't hit for a while. And he walks. Yeah, so he gets on board, you know. I'll take it. Lewis Robert strikes out. Two down, a man on, and Lurie Garcia up, and he strikes out. So we're locked in a 1-1 game here, and Lurie just hit. So let's see what I can do here. Let's see. Anybody else play short? Anyone? Bueller? All right. Um, hmm. All right. I guess I'm just going to bring in a pitcher then. The bat and Tilson spot. I was thinking of a double switch, but probably not the greatest of ideas. And he brings in Ryan Braun to pinch hit against Osage. But that's an out. And then Sogard is up. And Sogard can hit a ground ball to Mancata. And he's out. And Holt is up and out. So we got the top of the eighth here. We're still in a 1-1 game. And Mancata at the plate. And he strikes out. Abreu coming up against Jackson, whoever Jackson is. And he strikes out. And Grandall is up. And he strikes out. And Jackson is probably not going to hit. He isn't. They bring in RC at a pinch hit for him, and he grounds out. Bottom of the eighth here. Critical inning. And uh, Kane is out. That's two down. So Osage has been pitching great, but he allows a single to Yelich. I'm not going to, you know, fault him for that. It is Yelich. And there's a ground ball to second, and that's Madrigal. Not in time. Come on. All right. Here is up. And here is hit by a pitch. I don't like the looks of this. Bases are loaded with two down. Garcia up and he hits a ground ball. Thank you. All right. Jimenez up. Come on. Let's let's jack one out of here and get the lead. It's going to be a ground ball somewhere. To Albers. And he makes the play. So Mazar is up. Swing away, they bring in Guerra. And Guerra is going to give up a single to Mazzara. Madrigal up. Madrigal, no. He flies out. All right, Osich, two down. I guess we're going to have to go get him. Uh, and pinch hit. Oh, wait a minute. Cancel. I'm so used to being at home. Um, we are going to, he's a righty who's a 2L.
Uh, we're gonna pinch hit Collins. I mean, why not? I might as well get all the crappy hitters out of the way. And he walks. Two crappy hitters, two walks. Lewis Robert, come on, knock him in, man. No. It's going to be a pop out. All right, so the last hitter was Robert. But oh, we're not placing Robert. No way. So um, I'm going to bring in C Sheck. It's been a while since C Sheck has pitched. So we're going to let him pitch to Pena. I think that's to the catcher. Yeah. He makes the, the catch. So guard is up. He is just going to be out. And now he's got a tough decision. Or no, I thought the pitcher was up. So it's hold. That's not a tough decision at all. That hold hit. He gets a single. And now Gare is up and now he has the decision. And he brings in Ryan Healy to pinch hit. And we're both going through our, our bullpens at an alarming rate, but he has more of a bullpen to go through. Garcia is up. And he's gonna single. Yeah, we gotta we gotta score quickly. Moncada's up. And he hits a ground ball first base that moves Garcia at least into scoring position. And now Abreu is up, and he hits the ground ball to second that moves Garcia over to third. All of this moving people over is great. And now we got two outs. And can we get it past the catcher? No. So we got c Shack pitching his second inning. He walks the leadoff man, and that's Kane. That's bad news. Yelich is up, and he walks. So now it's real bad news. And yes, there he is. He's tired while we're letting him keep pitching. Ground ball to the pitcher. And that's an E1. We might as well just let him. Yeah, okay. He did blow the game. Missed it by that much. All right, so that's what happened. We lose game one, two to one. Pretty uh, heartbreaking loss. Play the day. And there you go, Michael Kopech. I brought him up. You like that, don't you? I brought Michael Kopech up for this game. All right. And, uh, yeah. Looks like a more reasonable lineup. And especially since now, I mean, we need this win just to split with him. Because we couldn't get two stinking runs in the first game. Robert is out. Garcia is up. He strikes out. Moncada is up. He's, he'll swing away. I mean, apparently, if there were a season, Moncada going deep. If there were a season, Kopech would be ready by this date in the season. In fact, he would be ready really by opening day if they needed him to be ready by opening day. And there's a strikeout of Abreu. But we do have a run on a, on a jack, on a deep jack. And now we got Kopech pitching, which is great. Single one to five? No. Try it again. You're going to hear this. Eh, eh, that means try again. So Yelich is up. He strikes out. And Smoke is up. And he's going to ground to second. And that is Garcia this time. He played it into a single, and now Hira is up, and Hira is going to hit a double, and, well, uh, we're, I can bet Smoke is not going to score. Smoke is slower than I am. So that brings up Garcia, and that's a strikeout. So he does get out of it. 
nicely. Well, not really nicely, but Grandall is up at the plate and he walks. Now we need to score a crap load of runs right here. Jimenez is up and he singles. No, I think I'll hold at 25%. Thank you. Um, Mazzara. I'm going to get away with Mazzara. Walk. There we go. See, it, never sacrifice. It's stupid. Mendick is up and he strikes out. Kopak is up. Kopak is going to hit a ground ball to the pitcher. And he beats the throw. Kopech beats the throw for a single, infield single. Roberts up and he singles. Oh, I think we got us all the runs we need. Hold the runners. One out. Garcia up. And he's going to hit a ground ball double play. Good thing he was back for that. Double one to eight, but it's a fly ball. So we got a 3 nothing lead here in the bottom of the second of game two. And Sogard is up, and what was that? Eric Sogard. And he flies, a Spangenberger flies out. Got a Spangenberger sighting. And Adrian Hauser strikes out. How did he all, man, that's a lot of walks on a card for a pitcher. Moncada's up at the plate. He's out. Abreu's up. And he's out and Grandall is up. And he walks. That's his second walk of the game, and that brings up Jimenez, and Jimenez is going to be out on a fly out. But we still got a good 3 nothing lead with our man Kopech on the mound. And if you think I'm concerned about Tommy John surgery, I'm not. If Kopech can pitch 8 or 9, he's going to pitch 8 or 9. That's going to be a fly out for Yelich, 2 down, but that's the way I would be in real life, too. Again, there's really no evidence that shows if you had Tommy John surgery that you should be handing kid gloves. Um, Mazzara is up, and he is going to be out. And Mendick is up, top of the fourth here, and he's just doubling, doubling into the gap. One out, one on at second. Kopech up. I love Kopech hitting away. Fly ball to center. Probably won't advance Mendick, but, but you know. And Lewis Robert. And he strikes out. So we go to the bottom of the fourth. We're still winning 3 nothing. Hira is out. Garcia's out. He singles. Narvaez is up. He walks. So Kopech put two guys on here with one out in the fourth. He's put three guys on here with one out. And Spangenberger up. Thank God Spangenberger's up. And he flies out. And that may score Garcia. I'm going to stop the other runner from advancing. And so now it's 3-1, and uh, Hauser hits the fly ball to right, which is going to be a double because Mazar is out there. So it's 3-2. Let's hope he can get Kane out, and he can. I was I was worried that the third run was going to score, him, but it didn't. So Garcia is up, and now we don't have a big lead anymore or what's even resembles close to a big lead. Moncada up with one away. He strikes out. And that brings up a brand new. 
And he's out. All right, bottom of the fifth. Yelich leading off against our man Kopech, who has really not been all that impressive. But that should be a fly ball out. But again, it's really the bad defense that we have that we have to put up with. And there it is again, right field, Mazzara. Can't get it, so it's a single. Here is up, and Hira is going to single double last pass, probably. And he does, so now we need a double play, and I'm going to play for the double play. And uh, we may not get it because we have a four at second. So there's two out, and they tied the game. And that brings up fly ball to the left, and that's Jimenez. Could be another base hit. Yeah, ball's in front of him. Uh, we're going to let Kopech at least finish the inning. And, uh, well, maybe. Because that's a base hit. Come on, let's get out of this. All right, strikeout. All right, now they lead 4-3, to three, top of the sixth, Grandall up. He strikes out. Claudio is on to pitch for them. Jimenez. He grounds out. Our usually great offense has really left the building. Mazzara is going to hit a double, ripping a double. And that brings up Mendick. And Mendick is going to hit. Is it a home run? Let's see. Be at least a double. Yes, it is a home run. And now we will pinch hit for uh, Kopech, and we have a 5-4 lead. And now Kopech might even get the win. I mean, who knows? Um, I'm going to bring in Bummer. Oh, wait a minute. No, I need a pinch hitter right now. So we're going to bring in uh, Ancanarcion to pinch hit. He'll swing away, and he strikes out. And, uh, yeah, we're going to put in Bummer now. And let's hope that Bummer can get us through this. Because that was kind of an early exit by Kopech. I mean, if I'm being totally honest. Kane is up. Kane strikes out. And Yelich is up. We have a 5-4 lead here. And that's going to be a fly ball for Yelich. Lewis Robert is leading off for us in the top of the seventh. And he'll be out on a line out. Garcia's up. And he is going to single. And now Claudio is tired. Moncada's up. And he strikes out. So there's two down with Garcia at first and Abreu up. And he is going to fly out. So we have a 5-4 lead. And Bummer still out on the mound pitching the smoke. And that's the ground ball. It's a second who is terrible. But he made the out. Good. Here is up. He hits a ground ball to shortstop. It was terrible. It's a running theme for us. But there's an out, and so Garcia's up. And that's going to be a single. And that brings up Narvaez. And that's a walk. Two on. Freddy Peralta up. They pinch hit with Braun. And Braun, of course, hits a three-run home run. Thank you. 
<sighs> Things aren't looking so rosy anymore. And there's an automatic triple by Spangenberger. And Garcia's up, and he is going to fly out. But it is three, four, five, seven to five. So we have Grand Doll up at the plate. And he's out. Jimenez is up. He strikes out. And Mazzara up. And he's going to ground out to short. And he does, and now I am going to take out uh, the main man, and we're going to bring in Fry. So Fry pitching to Kane. He walks him. Yelich up. Yelich strikes out. Down by two. It's not impossible, but with the way we've been hitting, really, I, I don't give us much uh, chance of getting two runs in one inning. And here is up with two down, and he strikes out. So Fry gets us through the eighth. But we have to score two runs right here. Mendick up and striking out. And, of course, and it has to be done against Josh Hader, which... Is not going to absolutely not going to happen. I'm going to pinch hit for Fry, and that's going to be with. Um, he's a lefty who's a 2R. All right, I'm just going to pinch hit McCann and swing away. Well, McCann might have hit a double at least. He did. So Robert's up. He strikes out, so there's two down. And that brings up Lurie Garcia. And he strikes out, so we lost both games to Milwaukee. Denied. So much for playing on the road and loving it, because we're not. So that's what happened. We lost 7-5. to five. Two close games we lose to Milwaukee. So just want to remind everybody, subscribe to the channel if you haven't. If you like this content, if there's anything else you want to see, let me know. Like, leave a comment. But for right now, it's me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, signing off.